Oh my god. Okay, you guys. So I just finished reading every UA card, new and old, right? I mean, nothing's really like new, but oh my Whoo! Okay, like my question, because like, okay, my teammate Brandon, we call him Turtle, he's the one who brought UA up to me. He's explaining the cards. I said, oh my god, dude, some of those cards sound crazy. I want to build this deck. And then the next question, after I read all those cards, I straight called him as soon as I got off work. I was like, bro, why is nobody playing UAs? Okay, my question, never mind, people probably are playing it. My question is, why don't we see UAs doing anything at all? Like, and his, his answer is just like, I don't know, dude. I, I don't know. They're good. And I'm just like reading all these UA cards like, oh, bro, we're playing UAs going second, right? I was like, this is the game plan. Screw everything. We're not setting up going first with one negation with perfect haste. No, no, no. We're breaking every board. We're trying to break every board systematically. Or if it's just with one card, clean your clocks. That's fine. Dude, I'm so hyped. I'm so excited. My energy is just like elevated through the roofs, right? I'm just like, oh my, there's five roofs. It's through all of them. Dude, I am hyped, excited. I can't wait to get my hands on this card, on these cards. Told and told, it's like 14 bucks for the whole deck, literally. And it's only going to cost me more because of shipping. Like, seriously, honestly, it's not even the cards itself that are costing 14 because everything is since, since, since. Like, there's no card that's even worth a dollar. Like, literally, this deck is like a $5 deck if you want to get it just in real life. But it's just other techs, right? So, whew, UAs, this is happening. This is happening, okay? I can't wait to show you guys this profile. I have so many ideas just flowing through my head. It's crazy. I have to, like, write it down on paper so I don't forget. Like, I, I have already eight different builds in mind. Like, oh, there's so much, like, I can't contain it because I'm really, really excited about this deck. Like, dude, it, it, it's it's deck like these, man. Like, decks like UAs. Like, decks like, like, for hires. Like, decks like battery mans. Like, it's just rogue dude i live eat sleep breathe rogue rogue decks this is what i'm all about like i love the underdog decks and what i love more is like when nobody's trying to tap into the potential of it and you don't see it in the top cuts of any regionals or sheesh i'm right am i getting darker anyways when you don't see it topping that's what makes it any better it's not about the surprise factor it's like you I, you personally you want to be that person right like you want to be that guy that breaks decks like i want to be known like I, I want my name to be put out there. I want to be that guy that's known. Like, this guy breaks every deck. Like, I really want to be that person so bad, dude. Like, seriously. I just, I want to be known. Like, as, okay, Three Sacks is, like, the, the rogue lover. Like, he loves rogue decks, but, like, he makes bad decks good. That's what I want to be known for. Like, I want to be known for making bad decks good. Like, I just really admire the challenge of taking a deck that's tier three or bottom tier or trash or garbage and putting it in an elevated forefront to the point where this deck can consistently hang with the top dogs not just with a great hand just with an average everyday hand dude i am pumped uas this is happening this week is happening we got uas hopefully medulce's wind ups wind ups oh my god so many ideas for wind ups this is crazy right wind ups is happening Zephyr Orcus, it's happening. So many decks, like, I don't have enough time. I work 12-hour shifts, um, and it kind of sucks. It, get, it, it gets, sometimes it gets annoying because it's like the second I get off work, I'm really sleepy, and I just want to go to sleep, and I, it, like, it sucks. But it's like, I have to keep consistent content on my channel, or I lose subscribers. People leave me. People start to not like me. They start talking bad about me. Like, I don't want that to happen, so I have to just, I have to just really, like, find a way to keep myself awake. And right now, what's keeping me awake it's just the excitedness that I have. Like, I am so over-energetic because UAs is probably going to be one of my, nut, like, next favorite projects. And I really want to, like, take a lot of time in developing this deck as well as wind-ups. UA and wind-ups and Medulce's are kind of just, like, right there on my mind. My Murmurs are almost finished. My Infernoids are just done. I just need the extravagances. And I'm going to play extravagances in the UA, so I just decided I just need to get three extravagance. Uh, but, dude... Oh my gosh, that's really it. That uh, This is all I have for this video. Normally, I articulate a lot. And uh, uh, honestly, like I try to make my speech as eloquent as possible. Like I abuse my expansive vocabulary. But at this point right now, I just was like, dude, I am so overjoyed that I'm speaking run-on sentences. I, I'm literally like, I just, I can't contain it. I can't. Like, it's, oh, I can't wait, you guys. Okay, so that's all for this video. Thank you so much for watching this, you guys. God bless you. Make good choices. Don't hurt your brain cells. Stay positive, you guys, all right? Stay positive. Man, don't do drugs. Don't join a gang. Uh, don't talk bad about each other. Don't be trolls. Don't try to, like, get under people's skin. I mean, dude, honestly, 
we, let's just all get along. We all love this card game. We all play it. That's one thing we have in common if there's nothing else. All right? Let's make this, this Yu-Gi-Oh! community. Let's make it better. Let's make it healthy. All right? Peace.